struggling to remember how alpha and beta receptors actually work? Let's break it down in a simple way that you will never forget. The sympathetic nervous system is your flight and fight system. Think adrenaline rush. Body releases epinephrine and norepinephrine which act on alpha and beta receptors to keep you alive and moving. Alpha 1 receptor. Squeeze and constrict. Remember one, one big body and one big squeeze. They are mostly present on the blood vessels, pupil and bladder. So it causes vasoconstriction which leads to increase in the blood pressure and it helps in the pupil dilation because of contraction of iris dilator muscle. Like in case of the stress, the eyes go wide. Alpha 2 receptor, it is like a brake system. It mainly present in the central nervous system and reduces the norepinephrine release which causes the lower blood pressure. Think of it as a chill pill receptor. So for the beta receptors, beta 1, 1 heart. Mainly found in the heart and the kidneys and it normally increases the heart rate and blood pressure it helps in stronger heart conduction beta 2 two lungs mainly found in the lungs and the muscles they help in bronchodilation that is opening of the airways it relaxes the uterus like that helps in stopping the preterm labor so beta blockers like pedoprolol blocks the beta 1 receptor which is on the heart this lowers the heart rate and bp but initially sometimes patient might see the opposite results why when beta 1 blocks your body freaks out and tries to compensate by releasing adrenaline but don't worry, it stabilized soon after. Nursing consideration, always monitor heart rate and blood pressure and also the signs of bronchoconstriction. Never stop this drug suddenly. Educate the diabetics because it can mask the sign of hypoglycemia. And I hope this video helped. And if you like, don't forget to hit like, save and follow. And I'll see you guys in my next video.